my beloved love. Those feelings are valid and important. And I'm getting that you might be feeling that same confusion because again, sometimes you feel like really connecting, getting closer to this person. Other times, you may out of nowhere feel like you have to pull back your energy intuitively. You may even, if you're someone who's more intuitive about this specific situation in a conscious way, be able to recognize, I feel like this person is conflicted in themselves, and that is what is causing me to feel energetically pushed away. But if these intuitive feelings are less conscious for you personally, then this might actually cause you to judge yourself and to think, is something wrong with me for sometimes feeling really into this, really sure about this, and other times feeling myself pulling away. And I'm hearing your guide say, trust yourself, trust your emotions. Allow yourself to ride the waves of this, following that intuitive guidance, even when it doesn't really fully make sense to you either. Because the guides are very much involved in preserving this connection, if that is what you desire, and keeping your energy pure, high vibrational, and protected at this time. And again, I know I keep emphasizing this, but they want you to know that they are speaking to you through those feelings that you might be having about this person or situation, which could be changing a lot from day to day. So I am going to be channeling into a few of these spirit guide messages since someone's spirit guides do seem very talkative here. But while I'm shuffling the cards, I also want to share with you my personal most powerful tool and resource for shifting my own energy and manifesting in my life, and these are subliminal meditations. Subliminals are affirmations that are targeted to the subconscious mind, and how they work is they are actually embedded within other background sounds, meditation music, frequencies, and this masking effect is so powerful because it allows those positive affirmations to sink beneath the conscious filter of the mind and make deeper, faster, more lasting impressions on the subconscious mind. And of course, we know from research that it's the subconscious mind that actually controls 95% of our thoughts and even our behavior in life. So much of what we think and what we do, how we take action, is actually driven by these subconscious mind faculties. Reprogramming your mind using subliminals is like a backdoor to manifesting your desires in life. Personally, I've seen more tremendous, profound results from meditating with subliminals than from any other manifestation technique in my life. I've been using them for years now, on almost a daily basis, and because I've become so passionate about them. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.